The space race is back on, but this time instead of a race between competing world powers, it's a race between competing billionaires. Elon Musk, best known for co-founding online e-commerce giant PayPal and electric car company Tesla, so far seems to be leading the pack of space tycoons. His SpaceX company is set to become the first to produce a vehicle to dock with the International Space Station after its Falcon 9 rocket launches on May 19th. Musk says the accomplishment could open the doors to further space exploration. What makes this really important is, is if we are able to dock with the space station, it'll be the first time that a privately designed a spaceship has been able to dock with, with anything. Um, and that will, I think, really uh, herald the dawn of a new era of space exploration. Musk says he hopes his company and others like it can reduce Rainier flights to space down. to a fraction of the cost of launching Probably one of the now retired the NASA space shuttles. The idea has many space experts seeing stars. What SpaceX is doing is very important for many reasons for space exploration. If they are successful, and we really hope they are, in lowering the cost of getting uh, material into orbit or getting even material out of orbit to go even further, that will benefit space science, the types of things that Caltech is most interested in. Uh, lowering that cost is going to help NASA because NASA will be able to do more missions more effectively, cheaper. Musk's company has also attracted the attention of prominent policymakers, including U.S. President Barack Obama, who visited the company's launch site in Cape Canaveral, Florida in 2010. The dot-com entrepreneur turned extraterrestrial trailblazer says that in private spaceflight, he sees hope to reinvigorate the world's curiosity with exploration.